Welcome to Chapters of Cancers, my lovely Cancers. I'm hoping all is well with each and every one of you. I'm thanking you all for your likes, your shares, your comments, and your subscribes. I truly and highly appreciate it. But right, Cancerians, let's see what message of spirit has for you today. Let's see what spirit wants you to know for the month of March. Okay, let's see. I call on all elements. I call on my assigned angels and my ancestors to guide me in spirit and in truth. Any energies are trying to stop me or block me from delivering these messages will fall down and perish. Any energies that are being sent my way that are not my own will be returned to its rightful sender a million fold. Ashe and Amen. Messages for Cancerians, please, Spirit. What do Cancerians need to know, please, Spirit? Messages for Cancerians, please. So the first card out for you, Cancerians, is played out. So something could be played out. You could be tired of a certain person or a situation here that you're that you're in. We have love on the brain. So I feel like there could be someone here thinking about you. Okay, this energy here is clearly played out. We have creativity, steals your ideas, copies your work, duplicates, feeds off of you. I feel like this is you in this love on the brain energy here, despite the fact that somebody could also be thinking about you, Cancerians. With this daydreaming energy, this could be, it doesn't necessarily have to be love on your brain. You could be thinking about a loved one, okay? We have dirt digging, or you could just be in a loving energy or a laid back energy here, okay? Because it's like this energy is very chill, very laid back, whilst played out kind of feels like tense, okay? So this person in this played out energy could be the individual here who is stealing your ideas, who is trying to copy your work and so forth here, okay? Whoever this person is, okay, who is played out, they could potentially be this individual who is in this dirt digging energy, we have Carlos at the bottom of the deck, Queen Rising and Romantic Love Affair, okay? So with Carlos and this dirt digging energy, I am getting a car accident energy for some of you here. So definitely be um, vigilant and safe when you're on the road whilst you're traveling and so forth here. Or this could potentially be the energy of this individual who is trying to like steal your ideas, your creativity. They could be in this energy. They're watching you in this queen rising energy. And then we have romantic love affairs. So for some of you, this could potentially be like your own partner who is competing with you. Or this could be someone who had you in a romantic love affair who is trying to find out some form of information on you. This is someone who kind of like wants you to be like embarrassed or humiliated in some form of way. Okay. It's crazy. So it's like this person here is competing with you, whoever this individual is. Your tears have power. Let it go. So this person could be facing some form of karma. This could be somebody who potentially hurts you, okay, who wants to, like, get back at you for whatever reason. Things ain't what they appear to be. Your tears have power. So, again, it's like this is someone here who could be acting as if things are okay. This could be someone who is competing with you here. But, again, it's like... This person here is clearly going through some form of karma here, okay? Or well, this person here could actually be depressed. They could be actually pretending to be happy when in actual fact they're sad, okay? Why well, it's played out here, please, for Cancerians? Yeah, so this is clearly somebody who you are in some form of connection with, okay? This could be somebody who wants to come back to you. Some of you could currently be in a relationship and this person here wants to come in and sabotage a loving connection you're in. Yeah, the door, this person could be turning up to your home. So spirit could be saying like, set boundaries. Don't allow this person here to interfere or come in between a connection that you have or that you currently have. If you are single, again, this person here may be tired of like with this played out energy. They may be tired of having multiple um, partners, individuals here, okay? And now they want to come in and commit to you. It says, I can't help myself, the door. So this person here is looking for some form of handout or some form of help also to be aware of that. Yeah, let it go. I can't help myself. So someone who you've let go of is, again, trying to do everything to kind of like get your attention, okay? What's love on the brain, please, for Cancerians? Yeah, so you guys could be like, in a good energy right now, very happy. But at the same time, it's like with that love on the brain energy here in the new keys. Um, some of you could definitely be lonely, okay? You have achieved everything in your life, but the only thing that's missing is a relationship. So some of you could be 
you know, trying to manifest this energy into your life around this time. Okay, it looks like somebody from the past is clearly upset about that. Oh, well, <laughs> what's creativity for Cancerians? Yeah, so whoever this person is, this is this individual here who is trying to find out some form of dirt on you, okay? Behind this crime energy, it says pray more. So this could potentially be a Sagittarius here who is trying to steal your creativity or who is in this deceptive energy around you. Yeah, we have take notes, earth signs, and one chance. So this could be a Sagittarius or potentially an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, individual, okay, who sees you like in a nice energy or sees you in this independent energy. So I'm get, also getting the energy of the nine of pentacles. So this could potentially be a Virgo. Yeah, we have tell it like it is. Dirt digging, why is dirt digging here, please, for Cancerians? Why is dirt digging here, please, for Cancerians? Yeah, we have, oh, no. Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. So someone here is like worried, like this could be somebody potentially going to prison or this person here is going to be caught out. That's kind of the energy that I'm getting. This person here is going to be caught out. For some of you, this could potentially be a Libra, but this would be prison being arrested. And then we have dirt digging, cop energy, but I'm also getting justice energy. Okay. Oh dear. All right, let's see. Why is played out here, please, for Cancerians? Why is played out here, please, for Cancerians? I really feel like you guys are feeling really, really tired. Because I literally felt so drained just to tell you guys that. <laughs> Seriously, so... A lot of you guys really could be feeling drained, okay? It could be because whoever this person is that's dirt digging, they could be sending you the evil eye. Or they're keeping a close eye on you. It's also giving me the energy of monitoring spirits. So you need to pray against that energy also. Yeah, we have the Hierophant. So again, this could potentially be a Taurus or this could be someone who, again, wants to sabotage like some form of union, okay? Someone's coming in with some form of commitment and there's somebody from the past who feels some sort of way about it, Cancerians. Yeah, we have the Queen of Cups and then we have the Three of Cups, which would be your energy. And then we have the King of Swords. So this could potentially be an air sign individual, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and I was going to say energy, but I said enemy. So this could be like an enemy of yours. Maybe you you and this air sign had like a, a bad ending or a bad breakup here. Yeah, we have the ace of cups here. So again, it's like someone here is, is definitely in love with you. It could potentially be a Taurus. Okay, who is definitely in love with you here. But this is someone who also had a lot of options. But Spirit could be also saying that there could be, again, a water sign, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, individual from your past. Could potentially be a Cancerian, or this could be a water sign from your past who is coming towards you. Okay. Yeah, we have the five of wands to cause conflict. So be careful if there's, like, if there's like a water sign individual trying to come back into your life, Cancerians. It's like Spirit is definitely saying that you should move away from this individual. Okay, the chariot, the full card, I'm also getting like fast driving. Be careful because I am definitely like getting like an accident here. The five of, um, the five of cups, like literally, because like the full card, the chariot and the full card is someone driving very, very fast. And then the five of cups here is like giving me someone like, so again, just be careful when you're driving on the road. Don't be um too re reckless here. Because I'm seeing someone here, like, getting into some form of um, accident here, okay? Tell me more, please. Love on the brain for Cancerians. Yeah, we have the Page of Cups. So, again, there could be, like, a water sign individual here who could be, like, constantly thinking about you. There's a water sign from your past who is thinking about you here, Cancerians. Yeah, the Nine of Swords. They're definitely in their head, okay, about how they treated you, or again, they're stressed about something, so again, it could be a water sign who is thinking about you, it's crazy, because it's like, with the nine of swords, I'm kind of like getting a distance here, 
Yeah, and then we have the Seven of Swords. So it's like, Spirit is kind of like saying, if someone is holding back or if someone here is kind of pulled back their energy, it's because this person here is still dealing with somebody else here. Tell me more about love on the brain. Yeah, we have the lovers. Can't make this up. So it's like, there's somebody from your past here who keeps like playing games. So it's kind of like Spirit is saying that there is some form of a lesson here that you're yet to learn, Cancerians here. Okay, um... There's a water sign from your past Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, who could potentially be like a karmic energy here who is blocking you from like getting married or who is blocking you from definitely um, finding the commitment that you need here. Because this played out energy and this commitment energy, this proposal energy is like in the past or spirit is saying that there is somebody from your past. You could you could potentially still be with this person a water sign or potentially an Aquarius. It's like, this could be a proposal, but it's like this person here is either yet to commit to you or yet to marry you because the Seven of Cups is here. So there is an illusion. This person does have options. And with the played out energy, it's both masculine and feminine energy. So this could be somebody who has proposed to you, but they're already in a commitment. Or Spirit is saying that the reason why somebody is yet to marry you is because they are still married. Yeah, the devil... The devil and the ten of pentacles. Okay, I feel like this person's family as well. Um, or this person could already have a family. Okay, or this person um has multiple has multiple. So this person here could be into polygamy. So you could be dealing with somebody who is into polygamy here. Yeah, and then we have the two of pentacles. So it's like this person here could potentially have like two other um spouses here. So again, it's like spirit is saying like to be careful because if if whoever you're dealing with is dealing with a um, earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn individual, um, yeah, like they 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 both they both agree to this because again in the played out energy it's both masculine and feminine energy. So it's like spirit is saying this is played out and the played out energy and the proposal energy are two different energies. So it's like this feminine energy here is in the background, but this person is aware of who. This person is, which could potentially be your person also. So, um, yeah, be careful here, Cancerians. Why is creativity here? Because it's like they need you, like you're the source, literally the tower. Literally the empress. Okay, so again, you're a divine being here. You are a divine feminine. So there's something that they're trying to siphon from you or there's something here that they're trying to take from you. And in the Nine of Swords and the Tower... The energies correlate, okay? This is literally this. I'm literally getting a phallus, and this always comes out for you here, Cancerians, this um, intimacy here, okay? There could potentially be some form of crime here that takes place, okay? But there's going to be some form of tower moment here. Um... Spirit could also be potentially saying for some of you, the reason why a relationship here has been affected is because of an earth sign. There could potentially be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn individual here who is connected to your person who, again, is trying to come in between what the two of you have. Okay, there is clearly some form of competition here either from somebody from your past or somebody from your person's past. Tell me more about this creativity energy, please, for Cancerians. Yeah, we have the Queen of Wands. One more. Yeah, and then we have the Devil. So again, I'm getting like someone who is very powerful. With the towel, with the towel, the towel, the tower and the Queen of Wands, I'm getting a force to be reckoned with. Okay, this is why these individuals are obsessed with you. For some of you, this could potentially be like two couples, okay? Ugh, this is giving me like orgy energy. So again, this could be like two couples here again who are like obsessed with you, man. Because the played out and the proposal energy could still literally be two separate couples, okay? And on the five of wands here, there's like five people here. So I'm in the five of wands, again, there's five people here, which would be these two couples. 
And then you would be the fifth person in that conflict, in that strife here, okay? Um, Spirit could also be saying, going forward again, that there's a fire sign here. There could potentially be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius individual here. Who could be in this energy of being obsessed with you? Okay, this person has been showing up for some time, but the Queen of Wands to the Devil, again, this person is a Sagittarius Capricorn cusp who is, like, obsessed with you. I split the deck, the Eight of Wands definitely could be a Sagittarius here. And the Four of Pentacles. So, again, this person here is secretly watching you. Again, like, this person is hiding with the Four of Pentacles. It's, they're, they're keeping it close to their chest that they are inspired by you or again they're trying to be like you or again they're trying to take from you what's the devil we have the hermit so a warlock what's the hermit the eight of wands so i feel like you are getting downloads about this Okay, yeah, the Queen of Cups, the Two of Wands, the Ace of Wands. Yeah, like you are getting downloads in regards to this. So like you know the truth, okay? So a fire sign here is upset because you know the truth that they're trying to siphon your energy. They're trying to copy you. They're trying to be like you, okay? What's dirt digging? So they could be the one in this energy of trying to like... The seven of wands. They're trying to like cover this up. Okay. Granted, right the ten of cups. Yeah, so this person at the ten of pen. Yeah, the ten of cups. So. Okay. <laughs> so it's like this person here is upset that again, they can't cover this up. Okay, like again, this person here is like a criminal or this person here could be going through some form of legal issues or matters around this time. Okay, so they could may not be feeling as creative as they usually would here. But again, I'm still getting that you are a force to reckon with. The Hermit speaks about somebody who is protected, somebody who is preserving themselves, someone who is protecting themselves, potentially isolating themselves. But then that's followed by the Eight of Wands with speech about communication. Okay, things moving forward. So, yeah, like, whoever this person is, it's like they don't want you to say something. They don't want you to speak on what you know, okay? But it's like this person still cannot stop you. The full card to the Ten of Cups, it's like you're still going towards your Ten of Cups here, okay? The full card, I'm also getting, like, the Joker energy. So, again, like, you're a master manifester here. So, this fifth person here, this Sagittarius, could potentially be linked to... Um, these two separate couples here or this Sagittarius here could be going through some form of um, breakup they could be going through some form of rough patch here okay the star the queen of cups so star seed energy here okay you could be a healer I don't know cancers at this point I kind of like feel like you're over this energy Okay, you're just like, <laughs> okay, you know, yeah, haunted, memories, flashback, traumas, side effects, and then we have reflecting, so that's what I'm getting, like, whoever this fire sign person is, it's like they're inspired by you, you kind of remind them of themselves in a sense, okay, or again, they're haunted because of something that you're saying or something that you're revealing here, hearing, take me home, to the place I belong, but I'm hearing it doesn't matter, so something doesn't matter here, okay, or this person thought that this wouldn't matter, okay, them trying to steal your ideas or your creativity or something of that nature, yeah, we have dodging bullets, so again, it's like this person here is toxic, I feel like if you're exposing someone or you're speaking the truth in regards to whatever this Queen of Wands has done, I feel like it's literally making them mad, it's like you're irritating this person's demons, but it's very evident confirmation that this person here is obsessed with you, it's like what you know, your knowledge, you possess a lot of hidden knowledge here, like you're an old soul, you're a wise soul, okay, the truth is like, I feel like I'm also hearing the writings are on the table, the writings are on the wall, okay? 
I'm also picking up the energy of a Ouija board. Okay, what is played out here? Please tell me more about played out, please, for Cancerians. We have bank drop. So, yeah, someone here definitely could be going through some form of financial difficulties here. Okay, this could be this person's karma. We have fishing for comments. Okay, so this person here could be stalking you online. Okay, Seven of Cups is always multiple accounts energy. So this could be someone here who could be stalking you online. They may be witnessing you in a loving connection, a loving relationship here, okay? Or if not, this could just be the Two of Cups, simply your energy here, Cancerians, okay? This person here is going through some form of financial difficulties. Um... And again, they're feeling some sort of way about that. Again, this person here could be um, hiding behind multiple accounts here, attacking you verbally with the Seven of Cups and the Five of Wands. One more and played out. Yeah, we have Ain't Shit. Literally, this is the same person here who ain't shit. Could be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or a Leo. But look at the correlation. Ain't shit hand with a pen and in fishing for comments the hand with the pen so this person here is clearly trying to find out some form of information about you okay or they're seeing you online as i said doing well okay living your best life still keeping up yourself here but again this person here is going through some form of karma tell me more love on the brain please the cancerians we have carless queen rising so whoever this water sign person is, um, kissing ass, this is definitely them, like, this is so weird, okay, this is giving me stan. My tea's gone cold, I'm wondering why I got out of bed at all. Morning rain clouds out by window, and I can see it all. Literally, this, this person here is like, stalking you online okay shine clout hungry your light irritates their demon says anything does anything make shit up and dramatic so again this person here could be going through some form of karma they may have lost a car or they may have lost something here but whoever this water sign person is again they see you in this queen rising energy and now they want to come back and kiss your ass okay so just be aware of that because i feel like Things are being handed to you around this time, okay? New keys, keys to a car, keys to a home, okay? Keys to a bit to a new business, a new shop, whatever it is. Something here is being handed to you. You're stepping into the spotlight here. You're stepping into your power. You're being praised, okay? But again, it's like you still feel like something is missing. So this could be why this person is playing on this energy. Whoever this water sign individual is, they may know that like you're longing to be in love or you're longing to be in a marriage or a commitment here. And they could be playing on that. So just be aware of that also. But again, it's like you're shining. Things are looking up for you here. But again, someone here is trying to kiss your ass. I'm also getting that there could be an earth sign. Who this water sign individual is with, who you may potentially even know. Okay. Because like I'm kind of like getting an energy of someone trying to befriend you or someone trying to gain your trust here, okay? But this person hasn't been in your life for a long time. We have haunted memories, flashback, trauma, side effects. Or if they have been in your life for a long time, they could be all of a sudden being really nice to you. An earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So that's something to also be aware of. This person may be feeling guilty, okay? <sighs> Confirmation. They may be feeling guilty because... They could be dealing with someone who you're dealing with. It says stalker, stalking, watching, obsessed. So again, you're being watched here. Someone is definitely stalking you. They're crying over you because you've distanced yourself. Okay. Hooked. There could be something about a car here. Or there could be something about a drowning here. Because the car and the hooked is literally giving me... My eyes went straight to the car here. A car could be found in a lake. This could be what this crime is, okay? This Queen of Wands may be responsible for this crime, or this Queen of Queen of Wands here could be responsible for some form of crime here. Tell me more. Creativity. Why is creativity here? Yeah, we have looking you up. So 
you have a lot of people watching you for different reasons here, okay? Researching you, studying you. And that would be that hermit energy. There could be a Virgo here reaching out to you online, okay? Or there could be a Virgo here, okay? So a Virgo could be coming towards you or a Virgo could be carrying information back to whoever this fire sign is. Same shit, different day, shine and clout hungry, okay, divination abuser, pot blocker, so for some of you, this could be a tarot reader who is doing this, you could be a tarot reader, okay, these individuals here could be trying to block you, so this could be someone who, if you are a tarot reader, this could be someone here who is communicating with you um, via a fake account, this person could be pretending to be someone else to get a reading on you or to find out information on you, Okay, we have happiness hater. So again, this person here is, is jealous. Someone here is jealous of a connection that you're in. Some of you are definitely in a loving connection here. And it says, don't be fooled at the back of this here. So again here, Cancerians, you've got individuals here who are, who are jealous of you. Even if you're not in a relationship, they're jealous of the fact that you're just happy, okay? We have always partying, ignoring and moving on i feel like you're going to be having the time of your life with always partying okay three of cups energy that is your energy here cancer and so again i feel like you have a lot to look forward to okay um if you tap into your creativity you also will be very victorious in that energy again fake accounts fake social media accounts to spy facebook instagram twitter so again, these people are definitely stalking you, okay? There's a queen of wands here, like, stalking you, okay? It could be a Leo, Taurus, Scorpio, Aquarius, um, or an Aries or a Sagittarius here who is stalking you. Yeah, impersonator. So whoever this queen of wands is, um, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, they want to be like you. Yeah, and they are a cyber bully. Okay, so I'm getting a couple here who are stalking you online. Okay, or these could be different people who are stalking you, sending you spam calls, spam mails to irritate you here. Again, because your light irritates their demons. Oh, Lord. Dirt digging. For Cancerians, dirt digging. We have wants you back. Um, so what kind of narcissistic sociopath is this? So someone feels like they have to hurt you or be mean to you to kind of like get your attention. Who is this? We have legal issues, court, judges, immigrations, lawyers, etc. Okay, for some of you, this could potentially be a Libra who wants you back. Okay, and then we have moving. So, again, this energy is here. Okay, so you definitely could be moving into a new home. Okay, the person also who could be trying to block you is a, um, a Libra, a Pisces, Aquarius, Aries, or a Leo. Like, these are the signs that are just trying to block you from either finding love or, or moving on. But I also feel like someone's karma is um, that they will be locked up, okay? They may end up going to prison. Seven or ones to the fall, okay? That could potentially be someone being stopped from having freedom, okay? So an Aries or an Aquarius here could potentially end up going to prison or a Libra. But it's like Spirit is saying that this is like to protect you in a sense, someone being locked up for a long time. Okay, we have stable, rich, business owner, CEO, big dick energy. This could be like some form of, um, someone here could own a business, but it's like there's illegal activities going on behind that business, okay? So for, so for example, somebody could be a chef or somebody could own a catering business or someone could own a, a, a food shop, whatever, but behind that food shop, there's all sorts of shit going on behind the scenes, okay? Yeah, we have bad karma, scarcity tax six could be something to do with tax i don't know why i said it like that and too busy winning so i feel like someone here is mad cancers someone just wants you to be sad down depressed 
we have politicians and threesomes so again this could be a libra okay someone's deceptive ways are going to be exposed here i feel like whoever's stalking you behind these fake accounts you're going to be able to find out or decipher who these individuals are okay tell me more please we have cologne so this is clearly a masculine energy here who is going through some form of karma we have hairdresser could be an air sign gemini libra aquarius here tell me more please spirit we have no and hidden body so some so a body could be hidden um in someone's business place or again there's a masculine energy here who is hiding something again there's like a business on the forefront but there's something illegal going on behind the scenes what's hidden body for cancerians we have red light district so someone here is hiding that they have some form of sexual addiction here or spirit is saying that there could be a masculine leo here who is upset that they can't manipulate you the five of wands or they're hiding the fact that they're attacking you this is red light district energy okay and this would be the five of wands so there could be an aries or a leo here who is hiding that they are attacking you we have untimely death informer and gang stalking or again somebody knows that you know the truth we have queen earth signs cocaine so leo capricorn these toxic couples keep coming out leo capricorn leo taurus okay one more in hidden body for cancerians yeah we have get rich quick scheme so someone's running some form of um remove the skulls from your eyes untimely death that's what i'm getting like someone here is running like some form of dark scheme here behind the scenes so or they're using a business here to cover up what who they truly are or what they truly get up to yeah it could be this orgies transgender barber and gemini so there could be a leo gemini involved in this situation here okay but again the red light districts would be this orgy energy so there's some sort of shit here going on behind the scenes okay in regards to a business as i said someone has a business but they're using this business to cover up what truly goes on here okay um someone here as well could potentially have a fetish for transgenders here and they're covering this up we have hacker and poison again it's like the same energies keep coming out for you it's like you always know like everyone's darkest secrets okay especially if you are someone who is spiritual you're just intuitive overall like you know everyone's business okay and it's like how did they know florida water because you're spiritual snitch and you tell the truth bitch what <laughs> so again it's like it's just because you know what you know so we have delays here so something around you could be delayed and then we have viral moments so someone here could be trying to slow you down from having success here because it says stepping into the stepping into your power praise coming up and spotlight here so again it's like someone here is trying to cause some form of delays for you they don't want you to be successful we have red eye because they're jealous or with this new key new home new car energy here things could have slowed down in regards to that you could have been homeless you could have lost a car you could have had a car accident anything could have been lost or damaged or taken from you again it's because individuals here were um or are jealous of you here we have sun gazing so again it's like these people are mesmerized by you they're also jealous of how beautiful you are we have judgment okay so for some of you there's a sagittarius who is jealous of you okay who is um sending you the evil eye here okay we have trap house um someone again may want you to remain stagnant okay we have informer and then we have musician so someone here knows that you're talented here and someone here doesn't want you to kind of like share your talents or your creativity we have taurus so this could potentially be a taurus or a gemini here okay who's also jealous of you we have water signs 
and we have rituals here so someone here could have also been doing rituals on you what's rituals and then we have neglect so that would be a taurus so there could also be a taurus here nightmares and illusions so you could have been having funny dreams it was because of a taurus or a scorpio why is creativity here tell me more please we have lottery so again it's like spirit is saying that things are going to be looking up for you cancerians they're going to be making a lot of money remove the scales from your eyes or again it's going to be exposed what this taurus has been doing because lottery would be finances and then remove the skulls from your eyes would be this looking you up fake accounts energy. So there's a Taurus hair stalking you for whatever reason. We have DJ. You could potentially be a DJ. We have not worth the hype. We have fake love. And then we have karmic masculine. Who's this karmic masculine? radio presenter and crying so someone clearly is in the same field as you because dj and radio presenter would kind of be the same energy eviction and nurse health taurus energy so a taurus here is jealous of you okay um again if you're a masculine cancer and watching this you could be a dj it's like spirit is saying that like you're already abundant or you're already successful in this field and there's a karmic masculine here who is jealous of this so you could have a radio that you launch like online or some shit like that. Graphic designer mother, Taurus. A Taurus here is upset about how gifted you are. They see you as some form of threat or competition. Messages to Cancerians, please. We have broken limb, backslider, stagnant. It will all make sense soon. broken limb backslider stagnant it will all make sense soon so there's like a court case here that's going back and forth back and forth back and forth envy the judge is um involved in this okay we have envy and we also have youtuber okay you could also be online and something is going up down up down so like something is fluctuating we have aquarius disruption again it's like I feel like individuals feel like the only way they can get your attention here, Cancerans, is to like provoke you or make you mad or make you angry, okay? Some of you are definitely walking away from an individual here. A Taurus could be meeting into some form of accident here, a Taurus here, or potentially a Pisces here, okay? But again, there's like a Taurus here who is like laughing at some form of mishaps that you have encountered, okay? I don't know why, okay? But this person here is laughing at something that you have encountered here. Um, Spirit is also saying that you need to be careful of a Pisces, a Cancer, a Taurus, um, an Aries, or a Scorpio. Be careful, or potentially a Capricorn. Be careful of allowing these individuals here in your home because new home energy is out here also. So some of you are definitely moving, but these are the signs that Spirit is saying you shouldn't allow in your home or overall whether you're moving or not spirit is saying don't allow these individuals in your in your home okay um also because you've walked away from somebody here they're pretty mad you may have taken eid in the last reading when i said to you that some of you are in a relationship with someone who has been poisoning you um especially if you suspected this about a taurus here okay um this could also be the reason why they're wanting to seek some form of revenge, okay? A Taurus here is very significant. There's a Taurus or a um, Capricorn here who is wanting you to be isolated. They want you to be isolated or, again, if you're somebody who is creative, there's a Taurus or a Capricorn here who doesn't want you to share your talents here with the world, Okay, it's like there's some form of competition here surrounding your gifts. So if you do makeup, somebody else does makeup, but they feel like they're better than you. But deep down inside, they know that you're better than them. So again, they're trying to cause some form of delays or stagnancy for you. Right now, Spirit wants you to focus on your health here, Cancerians, because you are somebody who is very, very powerful. These internet thoughts, which we have <laughs> um, identified here, Okay, maybe trying to body shame you or they may be trying to make you feel like you ain't good enough. But in actual fact, they are the ones that are not um, good enough here. 
okay? Um, for some of you, you are in some form of friends with benefits connection with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius individual. And spirit is saying that this person here is jealous of you or spirit is saying that this person here is going to sabotage you. Okay. Um, this person may also potentially be trying to worm their way back into your life because they potentially have an STD also. So you need to be careful because I'm seeing that someone here is definitely being spiteful intentionally, okay? We have a week ago open up, so it may be a week now since this person has showed back up. Or again, Spirit is saying that maybe a week ago you and this person here was intimate or something of that nature, okay? For some of you, you definitely could be traveling, here. It's definitely some form of car accident. That's what I was getting like with the car in the lake. Okay, there's definitely some form of car accident here. What is definitely some form of accident, karmic couple. So this may be this karmic couple who has been like trying to sabotage you here with the feminine energy screaming. Someone here is going to pass away via a car accident we have air signs cousin i just want to destroy you i'm not giving up so this could be an air sign family member gemini libra aquarius individual or this could be an air sign and their family okay we have a year ago so something could have happened a year ago or somebody could have killed somebody a year ago via a car crash okay and they're now going to end up going to prison for it tell me more for cancerians Someone's body is going to be ejected from the car. What kind of shit is this? What is this? Ooh. Yeah, it's like this couple. It's like a karmic couple here. Okay, we have Evil Eye and the Giant. So again, this masculine energy here. More than anything here is, is jealous of you. Or some of you need to be careful because some of you are planning to travel and it's like someone's going to get set up. As soon as someone travels, it's like someone's at the other end at the airport waiting for them. I just want to destroy you. I'm not giving up. So this could have happened. This could also be someone who has killed somebody and legged it or fled the country or the scene here. Or clearly here when they're going to finally get caught. But again, some of you are traveling and you... Need to not tell people like when you're traveling, Cancerians. That's the honest truth. You need to keep your next moves to yourself. Bitch, don't kill my vibe. We have cousin. For some of you, this is your own family member that's trying to set you up here. Okay. What is this? Tell me more, please. So there's a new blessing here coming in your life here, Cancerians. Okay. Some of you are deciding to give birth abroad is also what I am getting. Uh, someone is also, someone could also be hiding that they have a family in another country. Okay, there's some form of information that could potentially also be coming in from somebody at a distance, okay? Um... Some of you are going to also have a baby here that's also very spiritual. Some of you are going to give birth to a child. If you have a child that's a Libra, this child has a higher calling on their life. This child here is definitely going to be someone who is very, very powerful in life here. I'm getting that this child is like a miracle baby for some of you because it's like even if, even if you're masculine, it's like maybe you were told that you can't conceive or you've been intimate with, you know, or been in many relationships and never been able to get somebody pregnant here. But I'm getting that if that's your case, like where you, you've been in relationships and you can never get the woman pregnant, whoever the person is that comes into your life that ends up having a child for you, you and this person are meant to be, okay? Because you and this person are compatible. So if the child is not a Libra to the cancer masculines, this feminine is a Libra that you're destined to be with here, okay? Um, someone could be also wanting to invite you out on a date here, but it's like, or someone could be like ringing your phone here and for some reason you're being called to not answer the phone. Okay. You're doing the right thing here. 
Um, there's also a water sign individual who is trying to do some form of binding spells on you. They don't want you to leave them or they don't want you to be with anybody else here, okay? Um, there is a there is a masculine Pisces here who is going through some form of karma here for attacking you. This is someone here who is sending you the evil eye, okay? Spirit is saying that if you are de also dealing with a Capricorn, this person here is lying to you. For some of you, you have a family member here who has also been trying to take you out. Because we have, you make me sick and then cousin. Why, why are people doing this to you? For some of you, there's a feminine... There's a Taurus, Capricorn, Scorpio, cousin or sister or feminine energy here or masculine energy, whoever, who is lying to you about their involvement with um, your person here. So just be careful, okay? You also have a cousin here who is trying to imitate you. Okay, this person could have also been trying to, yeah, I was about to say, spiritually attack you and then hex came out. So you have a cousin who has been trying to hex you. This cousin could be working alongside their uncle and their sibling here to do this to you. If you don't get up and chase your dreams, who will and open up? You could be having dreams about you running away from individuals or people chasing you. Switch lanes. These are. This is because of your family or your cousin, or whoever. Tell me more about this cousin energy. This cousin is an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn individual whose spirit wants you to be aware of. Goodbye, bitch, don't kill my vibe. So this earth sign cousin may end up passing away for trying to hex you. Oh, we, we have turned back and fire signs. So a car is going to go up in flames, an earth sign. You know they stalk you, fraud. Mm. Okay. Let me close out this reading. <laughs> Messages for Cancerians, please. Literally, that's my confirmation. What else do Cancerians need to know, please, Spirit? Closing out, what else do Cancerians need to know? We have High Priestess of Fire. So there's a High Priestess who is a fire sign, who is not individual. So this could be this could be a fire sign who is stealing from you, a High Priestess. It says letting go in reverse. This person will not... Stop trying to imitate you. We have loyalty, risk, and success because this is someone who is viewing you as somebody who is successful and they're feeling some sort of way about it. I split the deck honesty, so that's the truth. High Priestess of Fire. Yeah, deceit. So there's like a spiritual Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, High Priestess who is a fraud. This person took some form of oath against you here. This person here may see you as someone who is very unique. Okay, and they're trying to come against you. We have invisible, so they could be cloaking themselves or trying to cloak themselves in your energy because they're not they're not unique. What's individuality in reverse? We have focus. So yeah, this person here is trying to knock you off of your like throne. We have denial. They want you to deny who you are, who you truly, truly are. Like you're original, you're yourself, you're unique, you're set apart, and this person feels some sort of way about that. We have the warrior, okay, but you are a warrior. You will overcome this energy. Letting go in reverse. We have beauty. You're beautiful, it's true. Yep. Yeah, and we have loyalty. Like, you're somebody who's very beautiful. We have risk here at the bottom of the deck. You're a very beautiful soul inside and out. I feel like you're a risk taker. You take risks that individuals may not take okay but then when you take these risks and have success people look at you like you're crazy and then want to be like you we have listening so like these people are like <laughs> your sons you are helping these people find themselves but it's like they don't want to give you credit for it okay right let's close out this reading closing out let's see what else spirit wants you to know let's see one card please <sighs> for the last time cancer Buy the lottery, okay? <laughs> oh, buy the lottery. Money, money, money is coming. And people are mad because money looks good on you. Oh, well, okay. So with that being said, I wish you guys all the best. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I'll touch base with you guys whenever I feel like. Take care, guys.